is old school. This is how we climb. Technical progress. Woo! Woo! Step up. Another step up. Woo! Yeah! Is this a crazy design? Of course it is, because this design comes from Iceland Reykjavik, Straukar Kvedia. Uh, these guys from Reykjavik have made the lightest fork, which they call is made for cross country. Uh, it is the fastest with the lowest unspring weight fork. This whole thing weighs about 1000 grams, so it's feather weight. This is the best thing for gravel bikes. If you want to have some cushioning at the front on your gravel bike, by Leuf, you spend a lot of money, you will have super light fork and you will be super happy with it. But sorry guys from Reykjavik, don't buy it for cross-country racing. Some of you may know that I've broken half of my number four uh, tooth preparing for quite an extreme cross-country race in Poland. This was for the, for the Polish Cup. Why did it happen? I have narrow tires, super narrow rims. I have 27.5 inch wheels, which I love and I will stick to 27.5 for cross country. But also I have 50 millimeters of travel with no rebound. And then there was a jump. There was uh, the off camber section with the roots and that's where the, this fork comes to die because you need the rebound. The rebound system will soak up the energy that no. you put into the fork when it hits huge bump. This is why I would not recommend this fork for serious cross-country technical racing. For some MTB marathons or uphill races, MTB uphill races, sweet thing. For cross-country, no. Why is this amazing for gravel? We've got these leaves here. Leuf in Icelandic means leaf. We've got three here, three here on both sides. That gives us 12 leaves which are made from bomb-proof glass fiber. You won't be able to crack it, to break it, to do anything to it. And it's so light, so that when you are riding on the gravel, it will actually react to the smallest bumps. The design, I absolutely love it. Uh, I think it's like the candle that I left you. You either love it or you hate it. I love it. Everyone on some events will be asking, what kind of fork you have? Because this is not so common. But it's super light, expensive, very high quality, it's bulletproof, it's great for gravel biking, gravel riding, gravel grinding and for endurance bikes uh, if you're riding on some bad condition uh, tarmac roads. Sweet thing! So guys from Reykjavik, thanks for giving me a nice discount on this one. This will be replaced back by my RockShox seat, but for graveling, if I ever choose any suspension at the front, that would be life.